Those old sayings, you know, those things that your family and friends used to say they would come out of nowhere, and only sometimes they actually made sense? They had to start somewhere. Who, what, where, why, when, and how? Some of those old sayings are not only ancient, but still carry an impact today. I live by one of those old sayings. Winning is a choice. The goal of these episodes is to help preserve not only a language, but lessons in life. I'm Arrow, and this is episode number nine. When your eyes are bigger than your stomach. Oh my. My father endlessly shared his disappointment with his children when we would order from the restaurant menu and never finish cleaning our plates. The phrase has many different variations. The earliest came from George Herbert's Jacula Prudemptum in 1651. He used the term, the eye is bigger than the belly. The comment was created by judicious men which is someone showing reason and good judgment in making decisions. We should make judicious use of our resources available. Now, as a child, I always wanted to know if my eyes truly were bigger than my stomach. Now, this is where science steps in, exploring that each and every time that we eat, we're actually rewarding our body, our lips, our sense of touch with a moment of celebration. Then we have issues with dopamine. It wants more of that really good feeling. It actually affects two different parts of our brain. This is why more people take in more food than what they can handle. One thing should be noted. Your eyes don't get bigger as you age. Now, the shape may change. Even your love for certain foods evolves. But I got to tell you, I'm very guilty of leading this life where my eyes are bigger than my stomach. And the only way that I've been able to get around that is I've become the chef of my own kitchen. I'm Errol. Your eyes are bigger than your stomach. Now that's something our parents would say.